You're watching the news on Bahrain International. I'm Hamid Shaban. Good evening. With the support of His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa to help the Yemeni people and under the patronage of His Majesty the King's representative for charity and youth affairs and chairman of the board of trustees of the Royal Charity Organization, His Highness Sheikh Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa, a cooperation agreement was signed at the King Salman Humanitarian Aid and Relief Center in Riyadh between the Royal Charity Organization and the Khalifa bin Zayed Al Hayyan Foundation for Humanitarian Works to build the Kingdom of Bahrain Health Center in the Republic of Yemen for heart diseases. It is part of the strategy and initiatives of His Majesty the King to serve countries affected by disasters and wars to alleviate their suffering. On the occasion, His Highness Sheikh Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa thanked His Majesty the King, the Honorary President of the Royal Charity Organization, for his generous humanitarian gesture to help the brotherly Yemeni people, affirming His Majesty's keen desire to alleviate the suffering of the Yemeni people in light of the difficult circumstances they are facing. His Highness praised the efforts of the custodian of the two holy mosques, King Salman bin Abdul Aziz Al Saud, and the United Arab Emirates, His Highness Sheikh Khalifa bin Zayed Al Hayyan, in support of charity and humanitarian work. He also underlined the support of the government headed by His Royal Highness the Prime Minister Prince Khalifa bin Salman Al Khalifa and the backing of His Royal Highness the Crown Prince and First Deputy Premier Prince Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa. He also pointed out that the Royal Charity Organization is keen to implement many developmental projects in sisterly and friendly countries and humanitarian and relief campaigns. His Highness stressed that this humanitarian gesture is a duty that is necessitated by fraternal relations and Islamic values and represents the brotherly unity among the contributing countries, the Kingdom of Bahrain, Saudi Arabia, the UAE, and the Republic of Yemen. For his part, the Secretary General of the Royal Charity Organization, Dr. Mustafa Sayed, said that the signing of this agreement is a continuation of the noble humanitarian stand of His Majesty the King in extending a helping hand to the families and friends in the affected countries. In the presence of the chairman of the Rashid Equestrian and Horse Racing Club High Committee, His Highness Sheikh Abdullah bin Isa Al Khalifa, the deputy chairman of the club's High Committee, His Highness Sheikh Isa bin Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa, and the chairman of the Supreme Council for the Environment, His Highness Sheikh Faisal bin Rashid Al Khalifa, the Rashid Equestrian and Horse Racing Club organized the 25th horse race meeting of the season at Rafah and Sakhir. It was held for the Bahrain Jewelry Center and Porsche Cups. Also present were Sheikh Hamad bin Abdullah bin Isa Al Khalifa, Sheikh Isa bin Abdullah bin Isa Al Khalifa, and Sheikh Salman bin Mohammed bin Isa Al Khalifa. At the end of the race, trophies were presented to the winners.
A very good evening. You're watching the Business News on Bahrain International with me, Mohamed Youssef. Bahrain All Share Index closed this week with 43,434,157 shares worth 7,058,296 Bahraini dinars conducted through 346 transactions. Investors traded in 24 companies. 11 companies witnessed a rise in shares, 7 fell and the rest maintained their shares. The investment was the leading sector and the commercial banks came in second.